Welcome to a tour of Acquiesce. I bought this boat new in 1988. Our home port is Sausalito, California, but we've explored the Bay and Delta, more to Catalina, and traveled to Mexico with my family and friends. Acquiesce is 46 feet at the waterline. The total length is a spacious 51 feet with a wide beam of over 15 feet. The draft at only three feet, six inches, combined with a collapsible radar arch, make it a great boat to explore the shallow waters of the California Delta, and it handles beautifully with only two people. The semi-V fiberglass hull has minimal exposed teakwood saving maintenance time and money. Acquiesce is powered by twin 3208 naturally aspirated diesel cats. 210 horsepower with only 1700 hours. Her maximum speed is 16 knots and she cruises at 12. She carries 500 gallons of diesel, 250 gallons of water, and a waste holding system with gauge and overboard and macerator pump options. Underway, there is an 8K Onan generator, a Danforth anchor with a Maxwell 1200 windlass system, and 300 feet of chain and rope. Moving aft to the swim platform, where the 11-foot hard bottom Achilles dinghy and 18-horse Nissan motor are mounted. The swim platform has two swim ladders and a freshwater, hot and cold shower. Now let's tour inside. Welcome aboard. Let's stop at the Mermaid Lounge first. This hard top aft deck enclosure is 15 feet by 12 feet with a floor to ceiling view. The canvas, which is new, allows you to open all or sections of the room depending on the wind and temperature. This room can comfortably seat eight. It has a built-in wet bar with ice maker and built-in wine rack. There is a swivel flat screen TV, one of three aboard and stereo speakers, two of eight. There is also access to the swim platform. Moving up the four easy steps to the flybridge, it features bimini top and wraparound seating. You have ample storage under the eyebrow and under all the seats for storing boating necessities. The flybridge helm station has VHS radio, speed and depth indicators, temp and engine gauges, and controls. It also has a four unit intercom system, allowing you to communicate while you're underway, even to the engine room. Moving from the aft deck to the main salon, all the screened windows make this a bright and airy room even when the windshield cover is on. Although Acquiesce comes fully furnished, the 10 by 12 salon is big enough to accommodate different types of seating arrangements. The flat screen TV, DVD player, and stereo are all built in. The reverse heat and air conditioning system keeps the boat comfortable in all seasons. The lighted control panel houses a VHF radio, loud, loud hailer, depth and temp gauges and alarms, windshield wipers, and windless anchor controls. Fuel tank gauges, port and starboard tabs, generator and horn switches, volt PSI RPM meters, and a Raython radar system. 
The built-in electrical panel with DC and AC meters and switches are all at your fingertips. It is one step to the boarding ladder for docking or fast access to the walk-in engine room. As we take three steps down to the dining area and galley, you will notice the custom chandelier. It was designed for acquiesce to handle rough seas. The teak cabinetry in Taiwan boats is legendary and this boat is no exception. The mirror surround reflects the light and keeps the space open and airy. Soft underneath lighting and a dim chandelier add to the ambiance. This table cranks down to make a comfortable queen bed for your extra guest. Deep cabinets under the seats and cabinets behind the mirror provide additional storage. The galley features a deep stainless steel sink. All the fresh water on this boat is flushed overboard and it's not filling your holding tank. There is a three burner stove with oven, built in microwave and trash compactor, and a new refrigerator freezer. The beautiful teak cabinets with a large corner Lazy Susan, the custom wall coverings and hardware, the track lighting and tile countertops complete this functional kitchen. Moving down the hall is the guest bath with access from the hall as well as the guest ensuite. Splitting the heads from the showers is a very convenient feature in this floor plan and one of the reasons I purchased Axwheels. The electric heads function utilizing seawater. This saves precious fresh water when cruising or anchored. The bathrooms also feature custom ceramic sinks, fixtures, teak floors, and tile countertops. Moving into the guest suite, you will find a four foot walk-in shower, which could be used as an additional closet if needed. Although there are four hanging lockers and 17 drawers and cabinets in the two bedrooms. There is also deep storage under this built-in double bed. This room has plenty of light and ventilation with two screen portholes and a large screen hatch over the bed. From the main salon, we move down to the master suite. This is a walk around queen with suede headboard. Removable stained glass covers the large screened in portholes. This desk or vanity is a convenient built-in. The TV and washer dryers are also built-in and hidden from view. The head features electric toilet, custom ceramic sink and fixtures with a tile countertop and teak floor. Like the head, the tub shower has a screened window so you never feel claustrophobic. The dressing area has a linen closet and teak floor. You enter the engine room under the master stairs. My mechanics tell me that this engine room layout provides easy access to the engines, batteries, generator, oil and fuel filters, also having running water available in the engine room speeds up the maintenance. Thanks for joining me on this tour of Acquiesce. If you are interested in a personal tour or have questions, the contact information is attached. If you would like a video of your boat, my talented friends at Media3 are also listed. Owning this boat has been a fun, exciting, and memorable adventure for me, my family, and friends. I hope your boating experience is as rewarding as mine.